The 27 km first phase of the Lagos Red Line Metro Rail is now commissioned today, being 29 February 2024, by His Excellency, the President of the Federal Republic of Nigeria, Bola Tinubu Ahmed. The occasion was graced by many dignitaries, which the governor himself was there, the president, officials of Lamata, and other government press starters were also there to grace this wonderful occasion at the Ikeja area of Lagos State, particularly the Ikeja train station. The first phase of the Lagos Rail Line stretch all the way from Agbado down to Oyimbo, which is a 27 km distance. There are eight different train stations on the first phase of the Lagos Red Line Metro Rail. If you've been following up with Lagos development, then I will tell you that the Lagos Blue Line is big, but the Lagos Red Line is massive. In the subsequent videos, we'll be walking through all the stations to show you what these stations look like. Just stay tuned. Oshodi happens to be one of the busiest places where you find traders selling on the rail tracks. I visited the Oshodi area to see what the tracks look like at that end. Yeah, that's what I saw. The track is cleared up. Lagosians now use the Prenshan Bridge instead of the Uri tracks. I also paid a visit to Yaba area of Lagos to see the current condition of that area. When I got there, I noticed the traders who sell on the track and have been chased out of the track. They converted the walkway and the pedestrian bridge to what they do on the track. Please note that this picture you are seeing here is not the current condition of the train, but just as a representation of what the area used to be like. Yeah, but this place is when I got there, everything was filled up. There are a lot of markets, a lot of commercial activities going on on the walkway and almost close to the main road on the um, Yaba overpass bridge. That was what I saw. But I sincerely believe the state government will take serious action. Why I didn't film them was because for safety reasons I couldn't. Yeah, the NRC and Lagos state government have done so well in barricading all the rail track to avoid accident and pedestrian movement on the rail tracks. This is what it looks like and they even put in more security measures to ensure nobody flies the, the fence. There are still finishing touch going on on the rail track to ensure safety when it starts commercial operation. The Lagos Red Line Metro Rail running successfully here in Lagos, Nigeria has been a dream we Lagosians has been climbing for for years. Seeing the Lagos Blue Line successfully running here in Lagos, I think the Lagos Red Line now is officially joining the queue. Congratulations, Nigeria. Congratulations, Lagosians. Indeed, the Greater Lagos is rising for Nigeria and for Lagosians. With the help of CCECC Limited, I was able to film the preparation of the commissioning process of the Lagos Red Line Metro Rail, which was exciting. The second phase of this mass transit will stretch from Oyimbo down to Marina where it will eventually meet the Lagos Blue Line. But before then, let's head back to the preparation process of the commissioning of the Lagos Trail Line Metro Rail. Are you excited? Please don't forget to subscribe, like the video for the almighty algorithm. Let's go.
Oh, our next update, we walk around this Ikeja train station to show you what it really look like from the inside. To see that, please subscribe now. Greater Lagos is rising, obviously. Please, you can support this channel by buying me coffee or using the details in the video description. It will be highly appreciated and well invested. Thank you so much. Please follow the one showing next on your screen. That come your way again. I remain OZ.